Hello Bloomies, today on Bloom Academy we're going to talk about on-chain data, a great way to analyze the crypto market and level up your game. Let's get started. On-chain data is like getting receipts for every transaction made on a blockchain. It's information recorded on a public blockchain that anyone can see. For instance, you can look up transactions made on Ethereum or the Binance Smart Chain using platforms like Etherscan and BSC Scan. Digging into this data could help you understand what's happening in the cryptocurrency market and spot potential opportunities or risks. By doing on-chain analysis, looking at who's buying, who's selling and where they're storing their assets, Crypto traders can track market sentiment, figure out where prices might be headed, how money moves across the blockchain, and even predict trends. For example, if a lot of Bitcoin is flowing into centralized exchanges, it might mean investors are preparing to sell, which could drive prices down. On the other hand, if Bitcoin is being moved into decentralized wallets, people might be planning to hold it for a while. When doing on-chain analysis, you look at different metrics like active addresses, transaction volume, supply distribution, and total value locked. Active addresses are the wallets actively sending or receiving crypto. More active addresses mean more users are engaging with that cryptocurrency, which could indicate growing interest. Conversely, a drop could show that users are losing interest. Transaction volume is the total number of transactions over a period. It tells you how busy the network is and reveals patterns, especially when things get volatile. Supply distribution shows how the cryptocurrency is spread among holders. A wide distribution means more people hold it, while a concentrated supply means a few big players hold most of it. By the way, if a few wallets hold most of it, that's a red flag. And finally, there's total value locked, which measures how much money is locked up in smart contracts or decentralized apps. High TVL means a lot of value is flowing through that blockchain, which can be a sign of adoption and strong usage. But never forget, there are also other ways to analyze markets like technical analysis and fundamental analysis. Fundamental analysis looks at the basic value of a cryptocurrency, how much of it is out there, how many people are using it and what it's useful for. Technical analysis is more like reading the price charts. It relies on past performance data and is all about spotting patterns from past price movements to guess what might happen next. So, on-chain analysis is a powerful way to see the big picture, especially when used with other methods of analysis. It helps you understand why people are buying or selling a certain cryptocurrency and how you can make smarter moves. It's not a magic bullet, but it gives you insights about the market that you just can't get from other methods. That's all for today. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video with your fellow crypto fans. See you soon.